to serve because it is better to give than to receive. I'm delighted like to celebrate the Shaw family and the Sharoon family and to acknowledge how happy we are to count them as part of this great community. We realize that America is at her greatest as I look out into this audience and see the contributions and strength and family richness of diversity, and the greatness of America. And now we have two more that are added to this greatness because no one shall be denied under this great flag. So let me as well acknowledge the mayor of Houston who is here. Please stand, mayor. I think I'm allowed to do that. This is the affirmation that this wedding is getting. The mayor of Sugarland, please stand, Mayor, and his lovely bride. The Council General of Pakistan, please. We are delighted to have you here. The county judge of Fort Bend County, Judge George, we're excited about you being here. Commissioner Adrian Garcia in his lovely bride. Boy, I tell you, we are going to be in good shape. We've got judges and district attorney, the district attorney of Fort Bend County, District Attorney Middleton. We're so excited and his, I think, lovely wife. Am I right? I don't want to make sure and his lovely bride. And so I'm so excited, I want to take a lot of time, but let me just in, in seriousness say that I wish you the very best in life. Your family has created opportunities that will generate from you many friendships. The people that are here tonight are sincerely part of your life's journey. Those of us in public service, would not be able to serve if it was not for the array of wonderful people that have granted us the opportunity to serve. That means we are here to be of service to you as you make your journey in life. And so it is my privilege to be able to say that even America is shouting when two people come together. And I look forward to having the opportunity to see you in your life and so I bring with me from Washington a wedding proclamation, which I will present to you to acknowledge a certificate of congressional recognition to Ali Shore and Elisa, a wedding celebration that recounts your, your marriage and the importance of marriage. And it concludes by acknowledging your two families and indicates that as you embark on the lifelong companionship, as I hope that life's most precious treasures will forever be within your reach and that your love will be everlasting. Sheila Jackson Lee, Member of Congress, June 29, 2019. I thank our table host, Dr. Chardre, for hosting us, and I thank all of you for giving me the privilege of representing the United States of America tonight saying everyone in this nation deserves dignity and deserves the respect of the United States of America. Thank you very much. Please have a huge round of applause for 
Congresswoman from Sheila Jackson Lee. Let me start off by saying good evening. Look, I asked uh, Mayor Joe Zimmerman of Sugarland to come and stand with me to Dr. Shaw, Mrs. Shaw, Dali, Aliza. All we will simply here to say congratulations and wish you the very best. So on behalf of 2.3 million Houstonians, may the best days of your past be surpassed by your future. Congratulations and wish you the very, very best. And Alan and Lisa, I don't represent 2.5 million, it's only 120,000. <laughs> but on behalf of Nancy and I, who's here with me tonight, we wish you all the best and wish you all happiness in your future life together. Dr. Shaw, to you and your wife, you must be very proud. Congratulations. It is such an honor for me to be here tonight. Uh, working with Dr. Mubisher Chaudhry over the last couple of years gave me the opportunity to meet Dr. Austin Shaw, such a fine gentleman, who not only serves at Baylor, but lends himself to events, community activities all over the city. I'm not actually with uh, Congressman Green's office, but he did ask me to present that. So, I would like to read this to you. From Congressman Al Green to the 9th Congressional District, Texas. Dear Ali and Aliza, congratulations on your win. On behalf of the constituents of the 9th Congressional District of Texas, I salute you as you celebrate this momentous occasion and milestone in your lives. May your union be rich, richly blessed as you begin your lives together and work collectively to nurture each other. Best wishes for an exciting day and a continuous lifetime of happiness. 
May the love you share always surround you and your marriage forever be blessed. Looks very good. So I had a long speech, about three pages, but when it's 9.52, I think I have to condense it, right? So first of all, I would like to thank all the guests who have flown from all over the world. We have people here from Pakistan, from Middle East, from England, from Canada, from all over America. So I would like to thank everyone who has traveled, whether short distance, long distance, to you all are very much appreciated. Also, also, the people who are in Houston, I have, I, we are so lucky to have so many good friends in Houston and Sugarland. They're just like our family, and all of them are sitting here, and we truly appreciate you all also. Special thanks to Mayor Silvester Turner, Council General Aisha Faruqi, Council, uh, Congresswoman Sheila Jackson Lee, um, Fort Bend County Judge Katie George, Fort Bend District Attorney Brian Middleton. We also have uh, County Commissioner Adrian Garcia and County Commissioner Fort Bend Kennedy Merchant. If I'm missing somebody, please, uh, I apologize, but I truly appreciate everyone being here. And this is an honor for us, for our family, for Ali and Aliza. And we appreciate you welcoming them to the, your hearts, to your homes, for all the things we have done in the last two, three months. Today is the last day of celebrations. And Mayor just, just on the way out said in my ear that I can dance. So I was actually thinking that I've been dancing for so many weeks that maybe next day I'm going to go to work like kind of. So please ignore me if I do that. Thank you very much and it's almost about time for dinner. Thank you. We appreciate everyone. Thank you very much. None of this would have been possible without her support. None of this would have been... See, her friends. None of this would have been possible without what she has done. Because, you know, I'm out sometimes late days, sometimes I leave very early, but she's the one who is the rock at home and takes care of everything. So truly appreciate it. Thank you very much. <laughs>